We have another uh, uh, nice view to show you tonight. That's what we're doing here at News 12 Connecticut because nature lovers in southwestern Connecticut are celebrating. A $3 million grant was approved to build the next section of the Norwalk River Valley Trail, but organizers say they just need a little more help from the community members. News 12 Connecticut's Sean McCabe has more. After the pandemic, I think everybody realizes how important being outdoors is, um, both for physical health, but also for mental health as well. Ridgefield residents may have a new spot to enjoy nature after a $3 million grant was approved for construction of the Ridgefield Ramble. It's going to be a 1.6 mile trail that commences here at this pond. The 10 foot wide stone dust trail will run from Route 7 up to Fire Hill Road. So we switch back here to keep the elevation a little more reasonable. As one leg of the planned Norwalk River Valley Trail. From Calf Pasture Beach in Norwalk up to Rogers Park in Danbury. It's 30 miles, varied terrain. Beth Merrill, the trail's executive director, says there's still a little more to raise before construction can start. $130,000, which on a grant of over $3 million is not very much for us to have to raise. Fundraising kicks off next Friday, July 2nd at Nod Hill Brewery. We actually have a beer named for the trail. Two bucks from each four pack of the One for the Trail IPA will go straight to the Ridgefield Ramble. We haven't packed it yet, but tasting good out of the bright tank, so excited to put that one on tap. Brewery employees looking forward to having a trailhead right down the street. We are all outdoorsy people here. Um, I think this is a really cool project that we're all personally going to use once it's all completed. Merrill says when it's finally finished, the NRVT will be the longest trail in Fairfield County. It's absolutely drop dead gorgeous and I can't wait to build it. In Ridgefield, Sean McCabe, News 12, Connecticut.